because in this video lecture I'm going to discuss what how to create new database connection in T Weaver. So here let's open this T Weaver. So there I'm using enterprise edition. So you can also do the same thing with the community. So let's do the database connection. So I already have the connection. So let's click on this new database connection. Here you have this different option to connect with the database. So let's uh, connect with the my SQL. Then here or local hosts that's taken server host that is local host or you can give your pc name and here you need to give the database so if i open this place workbench my sql workbench so here you can see root is the user local host 3306 is the port number giving their password so now you can see this is the list of database that's present there. So now here let's give the database name Sakira. Port automatically this taken. You should give here all this option that's available. So first that's fine. Let's give root user password. And if you give all the uh, correct info, then you can click on this test connection. And after that, click on OK. Then click on finish. So this is successfully connected with the Sakira. Here you can see this is a uh, Sakira database. This or uh, table that's project there. Here you can see the size of this table. If you want to get the or uh, table detail, you can click on this view. Then here data and this is here diagram. Okay, so this is how we can connect with the MySQL. Let's do some connection with the other so here you need to click connect to a database you have different option are available let's use their postgres so here this local host post this or uh, and your data, uh, username that's all come there and here you need to give the password and when you give all the connection detail connect here this you can get this is successful then after click on finish here postgres 2 that's come there like this here going to connect with the oracle so oracle here or here global data port 521 let's skip for there as caught and give the password so here you need to analyze host database port service name this here automatically Oracle 11G that's taken there. Here click on this test connection. So here you can see this is connected and click on finish. So this was here and uh, here you can see this is a schema and uh, here this card that's come there. So let's right click there here filter option. Here, if you want, then you can show only the escort. You can work only in the escort. This is the table that's present there. So this is the most uh, simplest way we can create new database connection in D Weaver. So I hope guys, this video is the helpful for you. So now this video is over. So thanks for watching. See you next week. Thank you.